Hello everybody! Today we are going to continue with the topic of a face type with a thin layer of subcutaneous fat. I get a lot of comments asking which type of massages fit for this face type and how often you should do them. So today I wanted to cover this topic, talking about massages that we already have on our channel and the frequency you should do them with. Starting off with a plastic face massage, this massage has a very deep influence and is done over oil. This massage is very good for relaxing of temple and forehead zones, opening up your face by influencing the cheekbones and restructuring the face shape by smoothing out the lower jawline. With this face tap, you should do this massage once every 7 to 10 days. Vacuum cup massage technique you should do once every week. However, you should pay attention that you don't create too much vacuum. The whole massage should be happening on the surface of your skin. The next massage technique that you can also do one to two times a week is the massage that is helping with regeneration of the bone tissue. You can rotate it with a plastic massage, replacing one another. Meaning that if you have done one massage in one week, then the next one you can do only after seven days passed. Gua Sha face massage with a scraper you can also do one to two times a week. However, if you are using a wooden scraper, you can do this massage two to three times a week since wooden scraper is way gentler. I also wouldn't recommend rotating this massage with any other deep tissue technique, but rather replace them with one another. Deep massages should only be done as a course, not on a day-to-day -day basis. During the course, I would recommend either one or two times a week, and you should decide for yourself which one you want to follow based on the personal state of your face. The following massage techniques you can do every day. Starting off with a scalp massage, pinching massage, active point massage, and the one that you do without getting out of bed. All of those massage techniques are listed in our channel and I'm going to leave all the links down below this video. All of these massages you can rotate, however, I would not recommend do them one after another. If you are doing the massage without getting out of bed on a daily basis, you should make sure that you exclude one exercise from it the one that has very deep influence and is supposed to open up your face. And for the end of the video, I want to talk about the Japanese massage technique, Zogan. If you have a thin face type, I would really not recommend to do it at all, since this one will get your face too slim very quickly. So now you know all of the frequencies of all the massage techniques that I have on my channel. I left all the links to the videos down below. You should pay attention to the changes in your face, do the exercise in the right way, and of course enjoy the process. If you found this video useful, subscribe to our channel, give this video a thumbs up and share it with your friends. And don't forget to click the bell in order to follow all of our latest videos.